Reducing Sadi. Industry studies state that investor-owned utilities are willing to spend between $1.5 and $3.5 million to reduce just one minute of Sadi. With so much at stake, utilities continue to seek new ways to impact Sadi. It's very difficult for utilities to directly attack Sadi, but they can isolate and address the key component of Sadi, which is CMI, customer minutes of interruption. Reduce CMI and you'll reduce Sadi. But haven't utility preventative maintenance programs and response systems exhausted the sources for reducing customer minutes of interruption? Historically, the challenge is trying to identify where the next CMI event might occur. Empirical data just hasn't been available to help utilities predict future CMI events. But that's changing. When you look at this Department of Energy study showing the root causes of outages, you can see that it breaks down into two categories. Root causes that are manageable, and root causes that historically have not been manageable. Over the last couple of years though, something very interesting has happened. A new technology and process has enabled a predictive maintenance approach for utilities to address this 31% segment of the pie, which is equipment failure. While this incremental segment of CMI can now be addressed, the question remains, what portion of equipment failure outages can actually be mitigated as to impact CMI and ultimately SADI? How do actual numbers from the field play out? One utility pulled a group of 54 circuits for us to look at with specific equipment failures responsible for 8 million customer minutes of interruption. Using the exactor process, the utility now has the opportunity to impact a portion of those 8 million minutes that until now were out of play. We realize that no one can stop every outage from occurring, but with every project we review, we help the utility to determine the portion that can be impacted. After an analysis of the 54 circuits, we determined we could conservatively impact 20 to 30 percent of CMI. Together with the customer, we determined the reduction opportunity was 25 percent of 8 million minutes, or 2 million minutes of customer interruption. 25 percent of 8 million CMI equals a reduction of 2 million customer minutes of interruption. Next, to translate that into SADI reduction contribution, we divide the 2 million minutes of opportunity by the utility's total customer base, which in this case was 540,000. This yields a SADI reduction of 3.71 minutes. Based on industry studies and customer interaction, we know that utilities place a business value of 1.5 to 3.5 million dollars to eliminate just one SADI minute. For this project, the business value was between $5 million and $12 million. Even at just a 10% impact, the business value for this project would have been between $2 and $7 million. Any newfound savings is great, but the real question is, how much did it cost the utility to achieve those savings, both in outsourcing cost and internal manpower and resources? Our bottom line figure, which includes not only the cost to find the failing equipment, but to actually replace the components on the pole was just $500,000. A $500,000 investment yielded a five to $12 million return. That's an ROI well over 1,000%. Let me say that again. For this size project, this utility spent $500,000, which yielded a $5 million to $12 million return. For more than two years now, the accuracy of the exacto process has been field proven across more than 2 million polls at over 100 utilities. Working with utility reliability professionals to strategically target concentrations of CMI, Xactor has shown rates of return that range between 200 and 2000 percent ROI and opportunities to make a significant SADI reduction impact. Sound interesting? The best way to start is to let us do an analysis of circuits and prepare a reduction plan with projected ROI. In fact, we'll do a complete assessment of your entire grid at no charge. It's easy, it attacks a portion of the problem which until recently was unmanageable, and the results will probably surprise you.